Hey guys, Alex Allgood from Broad Productions, and today we're going to learn how to create time lapses in Sony Vegas. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and show you the example. So, uh, yeah, here you go. Alright, as you can see, that is really cool. How did he do that? Ah, you get to show all your relatives and your grandma. Okay, um, but uh, before I get started with this tutorial on how to create a time lapse, I want to say that this is for. Um, there's two different ways to create a time lapse through a digital SLR or through a video camera that can record stuff for a long time. Um, now, in this tutorial, we will be going over how to do this with a video camera compared to doing it more professionally with a digital SLR. So if you're looking how to do this with your digital SLR, um, this is not the, uh, the tutorial for you. And besides, if you have a digital SLR that's capable of doing time lapses, then um, you should be smart enough to load the software that comes with it that will do it for you anyway. So yeah, just saying. Okay, so let's get started. Um, I am pretty lazy, and uh, I didn't have time to go outside and film a time lapse to use as an example. So I'm going to use some shorter footage, and uh, if you just don't look at the little uh, timeline, it won't make a difference. You know, mine's 30 seconds, yours is 30 minutes. So, you jealous against minutes or something or seconds? <sighs> you people, you people. I don't. I'm not sure if any of that made sense. Oh well. So I'm going to pull in my footage. All right. So here is um, a sunset I did. Uh, a couple months ago, the one you saw in the example, and uh, it was really easy to do. I, you know, to do this, simply, you're going to need a tripod, or you're going to need to set your camera somewhere where it'll stay still and won't have ADHD. So, um, you'll have to set it up and literally leave it on for as long as you can. Um, I have a uh, Sony HDR SR12, which records to a hard drive, so that makes it really easy for me because, you know, with such a big hard drive... Um, you know, I can record for, for hours and hours on end compared to tapes, which can only record like 30 minutes a piece or whatnot, depending on which tape you're using. But uh, if you are using tapes, try to switch them out um, right after each other because um, even five minutes in, uh, in a time lapse that you don't get can make a difference on your final result. So be fast and quick with changing tapes if you are using one. Uh, if not, then I recommend a hard drive camera or a flash base camera. So anyway, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to do is simply compress the footage through Vegas' basic controls. So you know if you click the side of your footage, you can drag it out making it longer or shorter, cropping the footage. But, little hint, click control and drag it in and now you're compressing it down. Now you can do the same thing backwards to put your footage in slow motion. But and this is a time lapse, we don't like slow motion. So you're going to pull it in until it goes all the way down. There we go. I Oh, no, that's not what I want. Um, so now we have some pretty compressed footage. I think this is to... It's times four, maybe? I don't know. I'm pr I probably just am spitting out numbers. Um, but anyway, that is simply not enough. So um, let's click on our footage and go to Insert, Video env Envelopes, Tongue Twister, uh, and do Event Velocity. Click that. Now you have this funky green bar. Now you see this little square at the side is where you can drag your footage up and down. So we're going to drag it all the way up because now we're increasing it by 300% if you read the little dialogue that comes up when you do it. So, um, and as you can see, I don't know if you can really see it clearly in this tutorial or in the screen, but it, the little clip mark that shows the uh, end of the video is now showing up right here, right here, and back here because it has increased it by 300%, making it into thirds. Yay for math. So, click that, and now we'll drag it down to there. Now, test out your footage. See how long it is, um, because this is your max potential you can do with Vegas. So, um, if it's not long enough, then what you're going to have to do is drag that over, uh, highlight the footage you want to render, go to File, Render As, and uh, go down to, where is it? Video for Windows, AVI, and click the default template uncompressed meaning it won't compress your footage so you won't lose any quality and then since we did select certain footage click render loop region only then click save now once that's done rendering uh, it will well first off 
a lot of you guys are going to freak out because it is going to be extremely large. It is uncompressed footage, so it's going to be gigabytes big, depending on how long your thing is. But don't worry, I mean, you can delete it once you're done, so you're not, you know, wasting all this space in your hard drive. But once you get that rendered, you're going to drag it in, and you're simply going to do the exact same thing we did to this footage, compressing it twice as much. And uh, that should be that should be enough uh, compression on your video um, if you didn't do... Well, if you did a time lapse for like six days or whatnot, then you're gonna have to do that a couple times. But uh, that uh, sunset time lapse, I believe, was three or four hours, um, and I only had to do that once. So that should be all you need to do. And uh, you know, from that point, add in some cool background music. Maybe add in some color correction, like if you're doing a sky or clouds, make the blue really stand out by going to video effects, color correction, uh, put in reset to none. And make your your mids nice and blue, like that. You know, it really just stands out on your video and makes it look better. Um, and as usual, if this tutorial helps you make a video response to it, please. Um, if you're having any trouble, check out BraProductions.net. There you can find some free stuff, some of Sony Vegas templates, stock footage, free sound effects, free uh, backgrounds. Go there, but you have to become a member, fast, easy, and free only cost you three dollars so make sure to go sign up today um, everyone have a fantastic day uh, rate it five stars because you love me you love me and by me I'm talking about editing your sweet 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 videos I feel like a creeper talking in this microphone hey baby how's it going uh? <laughs> oh you like that you like that I've been hitting puberty lately people puberty it's a crazy thing Anyway, I'm rambling on now, which is what usually end up... I can't even talk. Ah, I'm just done. See you guys later.